Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett and I'm the founder and owner of Tech Reviews and Help and today I'm going to show you how to prioritize your internet connections. A lot of people are having problems, especially on laptops, where they go out, work all day or whatever it may be, and then they try to plug into a ethernet cable, but the laptop still wants to use Wi-Fi over ethernet. How do you fix that particular problem? And um, and this is a potential solution. This might not work for everybody, so that's one thing I want to put out there right now. But this is a potential solution, and it's really one of the hidden ways. Unless you knew it was there, you, th this is one of the hidden ways to fix the problem. But before we jump on in, let's talk about a quick advertisement, and then let's jump on into the actual thing. And um, I'll see you in a bit. If you would like to support us at Tech Fuse Note, then please do one or all of the following. What you can do is you can select the Tech Fuse Help logo at the top, and this will take you to our Tech Fuse Help YouTube page. Or you can select the PayPal button, and that will take you to our PayPal donation page. Or you can select the Patreon campaign button and that will take you to our Patreon campaign. Now, saying that if you don't have the financial means or you already done that or whatever it may be and you don't want to do that but you still want to support us, you can also do some of the following. You can leave a like and share the, this video and any other video that you want from us and maybe even our channel and tell people why you like us so other people could come and enjoy this and also help build up this community. You can also, if, if you like to help us but you dislike a certain video for whatever reason, go ahead and leave a dislike but tell us what you don't like about it so we can fix it in the future. And also, as always, please feel free to subscribe and check out our other videos. And when you're checking out our videos, if you really want to support us, just go ahead and drop the ad blockers and that way we can get our revenue. But if you feel for, if you want to continue to use your ad blockers, then feel free to do so. It's not like I'm not doing it. Welcome back. Now, as far as things goes, there's multiple ways to do this as far as getting here. But one of the easiest and quickest ways I can think of getting to the network and sharing center is by just going down to wherever your internet stuff is, right clicking it, go open network and sharing center. And what you need to do is click the change adapter settings. And then this, this, it doesn't matter what version, it just needs to be in this area. Uh, it, ne it needs to basically say network connections and thing. So from here, you need to press the Alt key. And you might have noticed it or might not. So in fact, if you just touch anything, it'll go away. So that, keep that in mind. Press the Alt key, and you might have seen that we got more options now. And um, and if you don't know where the alt key is, it's between the command or the Windows key and the spacebar. So as far as that goes, I don't know why they're hiding this, but maybe they'll fix this in the future. Go down to the advanced, and then down to advanced settings. And then from here, you need to prioritize which goes first. So, for example, if I want this to automatically switch over to e Ethernet, Internet, over Wi-Fi, what I will do is, one of Ethernet is plugged in, what I will do is click the Ethernet, make sure it's highlighted, and click the Up button until it's where I want it. And, um, and then I'll press OK and then move on. So that's a big thing to keep in mind. Um, and, and if, if um, you didn't know that was there, then chances are you've never found it. Not, not many people actually knows 
about that little trick. But as far as this goes, this is not a guarantee method. There's some people who reported that this doesn't really work for them. But since this is a painless possible solution, I figured why not put it out there. A lot of people, most people say that this works for them though. Now, um, the other way is obviously by just turning off the Wi-Fi when you connect to the Ethernet. But yeah, that's probably not going to happen. But anyways, this has been Creep Ben, founder of Honor Tech Reviews Nelp. And if you got any questions, go ahead and leave it in the comment section. And I'll try to get back to you as quickly as possible. Now, if uh, if you want to add anything, then go ahead and that way help me, anyone out. And if you like this video, then please leave a like, please subscribe, and please share. Also, please visit the other videos on techfusenote.com. Also, please feel free to check out the Patreon campaign, the PayPal donation, and the techfusenote.com website. Now, if you didn't like it, then feel free to leave a dislike and tell me why so I can fix it in future videos. But uh, hopefully that you liked this, and hope you have a great day, and this has been Craig Bennett from techviewsnup.com. Please visit my other videos.